Hi, everyone. Welcome to Mermaid Radio. You are listening to this week's Universal Energy Reading using the 16 Kauri and the Veve Prophecy Cards. I am Mami Olafunke. This reading is in effect from today, Monday, April 1st through Sunday, April 7th, 2019. Let's get started. The Universal Energy Reading for the Planet this week sees six Kauri on the mat and Eshu Yamoja in the Veve Prophecy Cards. This reading says that Earth Mother wants to communicate with us effectively and she wants us to know that she's not going to give up on her survival. She holds herself sacred and she wished that we held her sacred as well. I believe that most people on the planet hold the earth sacred. It's just the few who want to do any old thing that they want to do for money, for status and power. Uh, but these things are really um, making it hard for Earth Mother to survive. We do need someone to clean up the plastic bags in the ocean. Uh, we do need to stop booming, uh, using a sonic energy to find oil under the surface of the earth in the ocean because it's ruining our ecosystem. And little do we know we really need the, the water. We need the uh, water to cover, salt water in particular, to cover up what is on the ground, the ocean floor these vents that come through as the earth releases gases they never we never even get to know them but if we had to breathe the gas that earth mother has to emit in order to survive we would not be able to survive those gases so we have to be thankful for the ocean we have to take care of the ocean that is our sacred fluid mass along with the air that we breathe Ashe. The universal energy reading for the people this week sees five Kauri on the mat and the Zaka Eshu in the Veve Prophecy cards. This reading says that people need to gather together to be happy and beautiful. Um, we need to honor our agreements in our social situations and to step back on those plans to renege. Um, will injure these relationships between us. So be gracious um, and honor your social agreements this week. Ashe. Mm -hmm. The universal energy reading for love this week sees eight Kauri on the mat and tambours obatala in the Veve prophecy cards. This reading says that love is good, love is great, and if you have love, um, if you have love, it will be a blessing to you, especially where you have plans with another to get something done besides just love. You know, love is good, but having a plan to get something done is better. And you should make declarations of love to someone who you care for and want to be with and spend time with. This week would be a good week to do that. Um, because people will hear you this week and you you might just get lucky. Ashe. The universal energy reading for money this week also sees eight Kauri on the mat and Osayen Ling La Su in the Veve Prophecy cards. And this reading says that where you have money, uh, you can make money this week. Uh, money is is not an issue. The issues will be around the plans, um, how you made your money, how you plan to continue making money. Um, be careful that you uh, describe this, that you communicate this effectively and with good taste and divine character so that you do not offend the people around you. Um, Let's let us try to be uh, humble in our prosperity, so that we can be seen in a good light, where people will want to continue to work with us and renew contracts and renew relationships. Uh, because this says that we can be a little coarse, rude, 
um, lewd kind of offhanded attitude. We need to stay focused and true to our integrity um, so that we can endear people to us in money matters. Ashe. The universal energy reading for spiritual development this week sees ten Kauri on the mat and Tambor's Aizan in the Vevek prophecy cards. In spiritual development, this uh, do not worry about where you are in your spiritual development. Uh, this reading talks about us maybe thinking that we missed something somewhere along the line, but we haven't missed anything. This reading says take one step towards God and God will take 10 steps towards you. There is an accord between uh, your prayers and heaven this week. So what you pray for most likely will become manifest. So ask for what you want. Be careful for what you ask for. Ah, shit. This has been Mami Olofunke's Universal Energy Reading. I thank you for joining me this week. I hope everyone is well. Um, happy, happy first of April day. Um, I welcome springtime. I pray that this season is good for us all. If you like this information and find it useful, please like, subscribe, add notifications to know when the next video is available. Have a great week, everyone. Odabu. Oh,